What's going on, everybody? Welcome to episode 25 of our West Ham career mode, and today we have got a couple of games in the league, as well as another game against Bruges, who gave us a tough time out of it last time. So we've got a couple of tough games. Fulham, Bruges, and then Manchester United. Tough stuff today, and we are, as you can see, top of the league. United, nowhere to be found. Top four, West Ham, City, Tottenham. And Burnley. Arsenal are right there. Chelsea are within five. United are further back. Liverpool are further back. And yeah, so hopefully we can grab some points against Fulham. We're 17th. We really need to win that game. And then Manchester United as well. But we're going to jump right into the Fulham game. We may have to rotate a little bit after our Burnley game just midweek. We do have to rotate just a bit. We will... Hmm. I'll pop a check in there to partner Rice. On your Kuru can have a start. Almo can have a start. As can Arnautovic. And then center back. Kanji needs a bit of a rest. Red Sauce can play. So can Reese Oxford. He hasn't played in a while. And we'll get Reese Oxford in there and we'll bring McKenney to the bench. Yarmolenko to the bench. Yes. Yeah, we can bring Yarmolenko to the bench. So that's the team we'll use. Let's jump on into it. Follow him in West Ham. One more. Arnautovic. Can he play him through? That's a lovely ball. And he's Felipe Anderson. Puts it back post. It's a nice clear. But it's come back to him. Have a pop. And, oh, that is not far away. Ugh. Very close from Pape check. Good start. Oh, that's dreadful. Dreadful, dreadful. A bad giveaway. And here come Fulham. Looking to make us pay for it. And it's a really good save from Onana. That looked like it was flying right into the corner there. A lovely save. Markovic to take the corner. Hooked away. It's come in and... In the back of the net. Bad defending. Really bad defending. Ream with the goal. Thought he might have cleared it off the line in the end. Not quite. Not good defending at all. Ball comes in from Markovic, who's been released in real life just recently. Headed up in the air, and Ream comes and just heads it on. Onana in no man's land. He came out to get it, got nowhere near it. And that is not good. 1-0. Not who I wanted that to go to, but he found a way there. And now Tavich, he finds Pape Cech, who's going to have a pop from distance, and that's blocked, but not very far. Almost directed into the net. And just goes over the bar, and we get a header on. And Klosterman looked like he might have grabbed that. Not quite. Ball hooked up. We get a header on, he can. Nice on Altovich in a bit of space. Run here. He can play that lovely ball through. He's got that in his locker for Marnautovic. And it's Felipe Anderson who has a pop, and he smashed the post. He tried to hit him near post there, and almost did. But it couldn't quite find the back of the net. It's Declan Rice looking for something, and it is going to be cleared, and we look like we're heading into half time. 1-0 down here. Bit lucky there. Bit lucky there. He's missed the tackle with the slide, but he's found on Yakuru here, and can we start the second half with a, with a bang? And it is. It's a penalty there. He's slid in. He's just had it. An attempt right there, and Brian comes in late. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Bad, bad, bad. And we'll definitely take that. But it looks like we are going to get ourselves a penalty here. Comes in late. Land right on his knee there. It's not a good tackle. Arnautovic to level the game up. And he does. And it's 1-1 here. He's not going to pick up the ball. He's not interested in that. He wants to celebrate. And off he goes. 1-1. It's a good penalty. Goalkeeper didn't even move. Right off the bat in this second half, we have leveled it up. And now we can hopefully take control and push forward. And hopefully grab a second and put ourselves in a pole position to win. Nicely done. One more out wide. It's on Yakuru. And on Yakuru's pace is taking him away here. On Yakuru. Has a pop, and it's a brilliant finish. And Onyakuru, who drew the penalty, has now scored himself a goal. It's 2-1 here, and that finish is something else. Just whipped into that corner. 
Lovely, lovely finish. Look at that whack. Right into the corner. No chance whatsoever for the goalkeeper, Rodak. And it is 2-1 here. Half hour to go. Moreover. And can we get it through? It's Felipe Anderson. He's found it wide. It's Danny Elmo. Danny Elmo, lovely ball across and a brilliant finish. And off the post from Felipe Anderson. And we just took him off as well. That'll be his last action. As well as Danny Elmo. And they combine for the goal right before they go off. And that was a brilliant counter attack and a great finish as well. Danny Elmo released by Felipe Anderson on the end there. And he's just squared it across. Hit it the opposite way. Goalkeeper can't get to it. And it is a lovely counter-attacking goal, and it's put us in a dominant position. 20 minutes to go, 3-1. <clears throat> Ball to come in on a corner. It's hooked in. Onana should collect. He punches it away. Not going to get to it. It's going to come back. And he's had a pop, and that's a really, really good save from Onana. And a really, really great attempt from the Fulham man there. Difficult technique. Oh, bad ball in. Oh, Jesus, he's saved me there. I thought he was going to run out to meet that ball. Not quite. That's a good hit and another good save. Loses out. Bad place to give the ball away. Lanzini gets a little bit lucky, and he's going to hold on to it here. Lanzini cuts back, looking for someone. It's Arnautovic. It's 4-1. It's game over. And we are going to collect three points. Arnautovic with the goal. Lanzini doing all of the hard work. 4-1, 83 minutes gone, and this has turned into a bit of a rout after Fulham have taken an early lead. Did well, just cuts back, lays it across, in between the man, and the defender couldn't get anywhere near that. Tim Ream just watching the goalkeeper, praying he could get out there, but no dice, and it is 4-1 here. I've looked everywhere. One minute to go. And forever blowing bubbles being sung in the away end. And we are going to collect three points. And we are in a good nick at the moment. Doing very well in the league. Still top of the league. And still in all the competitions as well. We are in a good spot at the moment. Liverpool beaten by Burnley. Who just seemed to not go away. City beaten by Southampton. Many other results. United win. Tottenham as well with a 1-1 draw and everyone losing points and we are in a good spot at the moment a good day to win considering all the people dropping points and we'll have to take a look just to see where everybody is as Oxford continues to come along he played pretty well last time around it's the center back and you only really notice when they're super dominant or they make a bit of a mistake so to be somewhere in the middle is not too too bad let's take a look at where we are in the Premier League before we jump into this big old game against Club Rouge both of us on seven both Bayern and Shakhtar on one and as you can see three points ahead of City four ahead of Tottenham and Burnley so let's jump into this Bruges game as you can see both of us on seven the other two playing each other as well on one a win here would be absolutely massive. It'd put us on 10. Second place would be on 4 in a good day. This will effectively put us through to the next round. So let's go ahead. Let's go grab this win. And hopefully secure ourselves pretty effectively secure ourselves in the next round. Sakaria. One more. Masuaku finds a lovely ball. And he turns. Has a pop. And that's a good save. From Latara Martinez. I was hoping Masuaku got to that gap a bit earlier, but it does not matter. It's 1 0 off the corner. And is that Latara Martinez on the corner? It's 1 0. 15 minutes gone. And a very, very good start. Amazing how quickly that happens, but he was just unmarked. He doesn't win too many headers in the air, but all alone there. It's 1 0. Nice, one more. It's Felipe Anderson in a good spot. Felipe Anderson tries to find that ball in. Not quite. Oh, and they're going to give me the penalty there. That might be... <laughs> I'm not sure what to call that. I, In real life, I think that would be a penalty. I think that's just the way the game worked out there that we take... that we get brought down there. 
and he's just come down and tripped him up. And we are going to have a opportunity to go 2-0 up. We're going to go right down the middle here, and he saved it. Oh, he stayed down the middle. Jesus. And depending on the... I guess that's sort of fair, but an opportunity to go 2-0 up, and we do not grab it. Oh, he's done well there. He's just sneak through, and it's a decent hit. And it's a good save from Onana. Took it himself, beat a couple men. Had the shot from distance. It's a good save. And it's a header there, and we are level off corners now. <laughs> One for each, and Bruges have leveled this up. And this is a really good header. No chance. And it is 1-1. Not what we needed to start this second half. Decent header on. One more. Felipe Anderson. Finds McKenney. And it's a nice ball here to Ismaili Asari. Who has a pop and it's off the post. And the computer had a second attempt at it. And it was a poor attempt. But off the post the first time. And Lanzini has it. And he's had a pop and it's a really good save. And a great response here to conceding that goal. Nicely done. Oh, it's a nice cut back inside. Plenty of men forward here. Oh, it's got to him. Good football from Bruges again, who just will not go away. It's 2 1, 64 minutes gone. And they are now in position to make themselves qualify from this group. Not good. It's good football here. And I thought I got a foot on that ball there. I really did. And I didn't. It's good movement. Good ball movement. Decent run there. But we couldn't find it. And it's Ismalia Sar. Sar gets it inside. Martinez with a lovely turn. Martinez. And it's in the back of the net. And that's a brilliant, brilliant goal right there. A lovely turn in the box. Just escaping two or three men. And a brilliant finish from Lataro Martinez, who's leveled this game up here. Right here, he's turned here. Just stuck inside there. Had the shot before he came in. And good, good goal right there. That's a lovely, lovely goal from Martinez there. And we have found an equalizer. 15 minutes to go. Oh, bad giveaway there. Oh, it's lovely. He's onside here. Oh, and it's gone in. Oh, Nana gets a touch. But he's finished it there. This ball here is really lovely. Even though I'm not sure where the defender was going. But, oh, Nana. You feel he could do better in a situation like that. It's hit him. Can't keep it out, though. And with five or six minutes to go, they have taken the lead. Two minutes. We need the ball. Oh, poor on my end. And we are not even going to get the ball back. They're just moving it around. Oh, well, we got it there. Can we get it out wide? We can. And we are going to have an opportunity here. It's Onyakuru. And Onyakuru cuts back. And Onyakuru finds him. It's Martinez. Has a pop. And it's in the back of the net. He's gotten a touch on it as well. The goalie. But it ends... Up in the back of the net. Martinez with his second. I thought he put it right at the goalie and he saved it. But 3-3. Three, three, and late drama here. Oh, he should be saving that as well. Both goalkeepers at fault, I feel. But both goalkeepers giving up a goal. God, he got unlucky, I guess. It went off his... Oh, Jesus Christ. Unlucky from him, I suppose. It's 3-3. Three, three. Martinez has a hat trick. But we are going to finish level here in a draw. I guess is okay. Bruges and us remain unbeaten. And our team isn't even on there. The other games in our group. We're going to have to figure out what happened there. Hopefully another draw. And then we're practically through again. We're going to skip forward to the United game before we take a quick look in there. As Burnley are only one back of City. Alright, let's see. Just looking quickly at the standings here. I keep seeing Burnley up there. Let's go to the Champions League and see what happened in the other game. As Bayern have beaten Donetsk 1-0. And we play Shakhtar. And Bayern play Bruges. A win for us would put us 
into the knockout round should we go ahead and beat Shakhtar. So we're in a good spot there, and that game will happen next episode, and hopefully it won't come down to the last day. Um, but we'll have to see. So let's go. West Ham, Manchester United. I dislike those pink things, but they don't go along with what we really wear too well, do they? Um, but we're going to go full strength for this one. We really, I mean, we could bring in Danny Olmo, I suppose. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll bring Danny Olmo in, and we'll keep the regular front three, and they're going to have the international breaks, and we'll see what happens on the other side with stamina and fitness. But let's jump into this game, a big old game against Manchester United. Let's go back inside and there's plenty of space out here and there's Felipe Anderson here Felipe Anderson can he get that ball over the top he finds his Mali Asar lovely football and that's a brilliant brilliant save oh man that's such a good move and a great save as well Out wide finds Felipe Anderson running at the defense Felipe Anderson hooks it in and it's Lataro Martinez who gets behind the defender there and he just jumps up and just pops it right over the goalkeeper with that header. The goalkeeper was in an awkward position. Really couldn't come and get that. And it's just poor defending on United's bit. Just a, uh, chipped in there. Goalie's not going to come get it. Bad defending. Not even jumping with Lataro Martinez. And two-headed goals from him. And that will give us a 1-0 lead here over Manchester United. Lataro Martinez. He finds Declan Rice. Plenty of space. And always rising. And it looks like we're going to head into halftime 1-0 up. Not a ton of chances here, but I believe we've edged it just a bit. Callahan. Good ball. Good find. Good finish. And I'm trying to get over there <laughs> on the right guy. Clicked onto the wrong guy, and the right back kind of faded away from him. And I'm not sure who this is. Hamilton. But, uh... He's found the goal. 1-1, 49 minutes gone. Bit of a sucker punch to start this second half. And we'll have to do a little bit better going forward, aren't we? It's the turn here. He's found him, and that guy's just... I thought I switched onto the midfielder. It did not. I just ran away from him. Couldn't get there in time. 1-1 finds him. It's Sicaria. Not quite. It's Martinez. As well, the turn finds Sakaria, Declan Rice, Declan Rice making a decent run here. Declan Rice looking for something, he holds on to it. Declan Rice, decent turn, that's a bit of a pop, and it's Pereira and go. Can we get there? Not quite. Here come United again. Good football, and Brasford has fired that into the back of the net and given United the lead. Not what we wanted. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant finish from Rashford. It was really good football. A lot of short one-touch passing here. Here it comes. One, two, three, four, five. One-touch passes. Rashford all alone smashes it past Onana. And it is 2-1 to United. Decent ball out there. And Ismaili Asar has got some space. Gets it back in. And can we level it up? And it's a deflection there. And just like that, it's twos. Declan Rice will take credit for the goal. But the massive deflection wrong-footed Pereira. And just found itself in the back of the net. No chance whatsoever for Pereira. And the deflection helps us with the goal there. He probably would have saved that. But... Alright. Back level. Just like that. 2-2. Two -two. Angelino. He's got plenty of space. Angelino. Angelino gets it back out. Felipe Anderson in plenty of space. Has a attempt, and that is just wide from Felipe Anderson. A good attempt from him. A good run from Angelino. And we just couldn't find the back of the net. They're very close. A couple seconds. And we'll take a draw, I suppose. And even though we're going to get another attempt, Arnautovic here does really well and it's Felipe Anderson Felipe Anderson looking for something can he get it back in he can and it's a winner another late goal and this time it's over Manchester United right at the death it's Lanzini and two minutes after the whistle should have been blown we surely have won this game Felipe Anderson plenty of space here and Lanzini is all alone 
right in front of the goal inside the six yard box no one near him Joel Pereira can't get there and what are Manchester United thinking they're probably thinking the whistle's gonna go with 3-2 and we are going to take three points away from Manchester United what a late goal a huge goal and that will keep us at the top of the table with a bit of space in between I imagine nobody playing today but wow, what a victory. A late goal. Late goals all around this episode. And we were the only one to play. And we'll have to skip forward and see what happens there. As we do a little bit more training. Ismaili Assar, as finishing goes up, we're going to wait for that to go up one more to 89. And then he'll be off of the training in general. So let's skip forward and see how everyone else did. As naturally, uh, Folian's... Transfer talks have broken down for the 19th time. And Tottenham are four back. City do not win. They draw. And we have a little bit of a gap to Spurs now. And we'll definitely, definitely take that. So, guys, I hope you folks have enjoyed it. Let's take a look at what we have next episode. We have that big game against Shakhtar. A game where we could possibly go through with a win. And then we have Chelsea and Southampton. So a couple of difficult games there. Um, before we move into a very crowded December. All right. But, guys, I hope you folks have enjoyed it. Stay tuned, of course, for more. And peace.